All right, this is where I BR with some more of uh, Blasting Simulator. God, I've even said, I don't even feel like I've said that name enough. That's the name of it, though. And this is the next level. We just got to take apart these two gigantic things. We'll try uh, just since there's probably the most area to fall like this. We'll try an inward approach. I'm looking as high as I can, annoyingly. So we just do one. It's like, oh, what the heck? I attached it to the... That bomb is just floating. I can't take away that one. I gotta try to... What the heck is it doing? Well, I'll just blow it up and try again because that's weird. Because you use the same key to remove and place bombs. You just click on one that's already placed and it removes it normally. But right then you plainly saw it was adding a bomb and I don't know why. So this I could look a little higher. Let's try it like this. Oh, no, I can't have that one there. That one. We'll have to put that in the middle with a A bomb. And boom! Alright, so I need a little bit more support on the ground area then. So, what if I just do the greens on the bottom and then uh, like this? Look at that, like, I think I know what it is. The model that the bombs can be placed on is a square, even though these are circles, so the bombs end up sticking that far out. So, actually, what I should do is, I can't, I can't remove those bombs again, annoyingly, but what I should do to get the maximum amount of damage done, probably, because it's closest if I put it on the edge, is go like this. Because that way it's actually closer to the building. And I'll put an A just kind of up here so hopefully they kind of don't fall too far away. And boom! Well, that was unexpected. That, how is that even still standing? Like, I don't know about these physics. Look at this. How is this still standing? Alright, so new idea. Put every bomb on the bottom. That is obviously what is needed. Every bomb on the bottom. Because something needs to blow up all these lower area. I'm hoping because I put a smaller bomb in the back, it'll fall the other direction. I don't know if that'll necessarily work, but that's what I hope for. So we just do that. And boom. Ninety-nine percent. That's pretty good. All right, sixty percent of this building. Got it. What if we just go? Bam, 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 bam. Out of bombs. Other bomb type. Bam, 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 bam. Out of bombs. Bam, 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 bam. And let's see what happens. I was it hit? Well, how was I hit by a piece of? Oh, is this blow up too? Does all of that blow up? Okay, so I gotta blow that up too. Got it. We'll go one there, one there, one there, one there. Couple here, and then the rest go inside. Semi strategically placed, more str more like strategically spaced though. Otherwise, I would, you know, have... Whoa, where did that one end up? No. Otherwise, they wouldn't all be, you know, sorted by color, basically. You wouldn't really want to actually do that. I don't know how I didn't get hit by rubble, but I'm thankful for that. Alright, that didn't work. Alright, so let's see. So let's let's take this strategically now. So let's just see how many bombs does it take to take this thing out. Can I take it out with just one? Alright, that is going to need at least two bombs, so... One, two... These things, how about these things? Can they be taken out with just one, or they need two? Actually, it looks like they don't really break easy. So, let's see, alright, we'll go... Two here... So we got 12 of these, so we'll put 
One, one on each of the bigger pillars, maybe. I hope they can actually break them, but I think there's enough for this. Yeah, there's enough. Good. And three left, so I'll hold on to them for now. Then we'll put one of these on each of these pillars. Hopefully that breaks those, and then we'll just say... Want to see on each of these pillars. Oh wait, this one has an extra pillar because of the doorway, okay. So we'll go... And we have to use the bees up. Put one there, and then I got one extra. Which I'll just shove on that, I guess, and see how that does. Okay. That's a okay. Well, that was actually pretty terrible. Let's see how much is how much is this blo worth blowing up? Like I know that tower is worth blowing up, but how much of the just the the pipes? Five percent for the pipes, and those will take quite a bit. So don't worry about the pipes. This thing I could blow it up with two bombs, and it's like, like ten percent at least, I think. Oh shit! That was perfect. I I just had an idea. So that gets me six. That's actually not. That's actually less than I thought it would do. But I have a crazy idea now. If I just shove bombs all over here and then push this thing towards that building, will rubble fly out and, like, do something? Nah, the bombs aren't... Ex they don't actually explode outward, really, on the things. That's kind of disappointing. Alright, so. So for this, I guess I'll just shoot them, shoot them there, and then it'll tip over into the building if I'm lucky. Otherwise, we'll do this. We'll do... Each of these gets a bomb, so let's see how many I can do. Oh. What is up with this texturing in here, actually, now that I'm actually looking at it? Ugly. But each panel gets a bomb until I can't anymore. And then we'll try having a B in between these two. Worry about that while later. B in between. B in between. Okay, then we'll do one on this wall, one on that wall, and then we got one more, so we'll put it on this wall, and then we got a couple of C's. So, see, the, the numbering is just off to actually really approach this in a too, log like, mathematical, like, place this bomb here, it's kind of just wherever you want. I guess we'll do one of that, alright, let's see what this does. That's it. That's a win. All right. Next mission. We, whoa. The hell? What in the... Okay, hold on. Interesting. I have to blow up the upper area only. Huh. Well, this is weird. So if, I guess, oh, I could go out this way, but if I fall in, I'm fucked? What's up with that? So if I just put one on each of these, will that work? Throw some bees on that thing. Fuck, I fell in. Okay. Oh, well. Let's just see what happens. 59%. It's actually pretty close. Maybe I should do this from the outside. I'm going to do this from the outside. Feels a lot safer. So I'll put A-bombs on every window until I can't. Then I'll put B's on the rest. And then I'll put a couple of D's, which I haven't got to use yet. Wherever else. There's some, like on some of those supports. And that should get me the percent I need. Alright, so there we go. One there. One there, one there. Oh. Ah. 
Oh, I hate trying to re-click them. You have to be too precise. Okay. And we'll just throw some C's here, here, here. And I guess we could try throwing the D's on the roof, actually. That would help, I bet. We go like, boom, and boom. Alright, that should do it. There's no way that won't break enough. Seventy percent. There we go. Oh, I should have looked at what it looked like. Oh well. So now we got. Whoa! Look at that bench. That uh, bench looks huge. It's just because I was on the train tracks, but that bench looked huge for a second. And then I realized, oh wait, never mind. The train tracks are really in the ground. Uh, so what if I just went da 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 da, and then bomb bomb, and then bomb bomb bomb, bomb bomb. I want a bombs, more bombs, bomb, 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 just bomb everything. All right, how about yeah, just yes, 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 yes. All right, there we go. And boom. How's that work? Decently, but not great. All right. So the plan of just attacking from the inside probably will work. I just got to plan it now. So we'll do... Alright, we'll do a bomb at every thing. Well, do a bunch of bombs there. That wall is gone. Do two there. That wall should... Well, let's actually... Let's find out. Will one bomb break that wall down? Yes. So, every wall I see is just one bomb on it and that breaks it. So we'll do one bomb on that wall. One bomb on that... See, this isn't... This isn't physically enough. Like, right now what I'm doing is just one bomb per wall where the walls separate. That's kind of... That doesn't... That's just... It's not as fun as some of the other games, the way they do this kind of thing. So we just do one bomb on each of these. Did I put a bomb on the other side of this one? Yeah. So, did I put a bomb on this one? Yep. So I think every wall is bomb. Maybe not this one. Could bomb that one too. And then with the bees, we can just put them on all the pillars, I guess. So we'll do pillar, 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 pillar. I will say this game does have decent ambient sounds. Ninety two, not bad. Okay. Does destroying the soccer post actually do anything? You can't attach a bomb to it, okay. Well that tells me the answer. Can I attach a... So, why can't I attach a bomb to this part? Why can't I walk any farther than here? I can't attach bombs past a certain point. That is weird. Alright, let's just splash them everywhere. And then we'll actually see... If that doesn't work, we'll plan it out. Okay, so there is a barrier. So what if we just, like, where is the barrier, though? It's Holy shit, those were only A's. Is it because I stacked them so close they were that explosive? Like, I never realized you could make them so explosive just by putting them close to each other like that. That was some crazy amount of explosion. And it's consistent, too. That is definitely unexpected. Okay. So if we just do... Ah, uh, not there. Like, one, two, three, four, five. How many can I do? Six? What kind of explosions does that get me? Shit. 
why are things flying so much all of a sudden? I, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't, like, happy about it, but... Look at that! It almost seems like just one bomb right there in that corner would do... Maybe it's the corner? Like, maybe something's up with that corner? So, like, what if I just put one there? Does that... Okay, for some reason in this level, things get blown the fuck up extremely easily. I have no idea how or why. But this totally changes the approach I've been doing, and this is actually more of a interesting level because of that, but it's nonsensical as to why I would do that. Alright, so I could probably get away with just doing one on each of these corners plus one in the middle-ish, so... One on the corner. One in the corner. I don't know why you have... I don't know what's going on exactly, but I'm happy. It's cool. I shouldn't be standing in the middle, actually, probably. It's annoying, though, because the barrier's outside of the area you can reach. Or, like, I can't go over there to put a bomb on that side so it explodes to words. It's just kind of... have to get lucky, it seems like. What if I was to do it just that? Alright, so that middle one is the part that's causing him to plunge away, so... What if we try it just on that middle one instead of the outermost edge? Will that do any additional damage? Because it seems like there's no way to actually damage that middle part without having things explode everywhere. Yeah, that's, that's annoying. The outer limit on this side is different than the outer limit on that side, so you can't mirror what you're doing. This seems very poorly done. Wait, now I can go out all the way... What? In the world? Now I can get behind it on this side? But there's an invisible wall here. So now, can I get on behind it on the other one too if I go that side? Like, these walls are so illogically placed, these invisible walls. Why are they here? What are they doing? And, like, look at that, I could get... Okay, well, this is a shit ton easier than I just put them on the back pillars. Just do three, like... Ah, miss that one. So I can't put one on that pillar, though, okay. So I'll put one on the two, and then we'll put... Just kind of one in the corner. I have to actually be on the other side to do that, so... Let's, um... Let's go ahead and just walk it. I was going to reset it, but let's just walk it. Oh, that's not explode, dipshit. Oh, well. If I climb up it, can I just jump over it? Will that be a little bit faster? That'll be a bit faster, at least. Oh, I don't want you there. That's so I could just jump that one and then... This is so weird, though, how it just changed like that. Not quite enough. What's left? Let's see. Right, well, I'm curious. What if I'm using D's? That's what I should do. I should put D's and see. You know, I should just use... Well, I can't use all D's, though. Okay, I'll use C's for the back. Ah, hopefully I'm going to cut that out. Uh, sorry about that. Quick uh, edit, hopefully. If not, oops. YBR shit at editing, you know this. Uh, but I had to cough. Bad. Hopefully it doesn't come back. It feels like it might. Not while I'm video gaming, you. I think it is going to come back. Oh no, got to finish this fast. That didn't work. 
All right, I'm going to actually do this next time because, um, ah, my throat needs a break. So, till next time, this is YBR. See ya.